Comic Promenade, abbreviated as Comic Pro, is Japan's largest doujinshi binding selling event. It takes place at an event event venue on Tokyo's urban coastline. Summer Comic Pro is held for three days in a row, just like Comic Con. Summer Maiden falls into the shonen manga genre, genre, which is assigned to the second day. There are four types of participants of Comic Pro: general, circle, industry, and staff. Industry is just like it says for companies who are selling official goods for anime and games. Staff are volunteer staff members who manage the event. Circle participants are those who are selling doujinshi, and general participants are those who come and buy those doujinshi. But something special about Common Pro is that the general participants are not just customers. General participants are still each valued, valued participants of Common Pro who aim to act with restraint and pride. Sakura told me that. That's the main reason this event's the event with hundreds of thousands of attendees has continued decades and decades without going bankrupt. The seasoned veteran general participants of Common Pro get on the first train the first thing in the morning and head to the coast of Tokyo and make a long, long line. They say it takes at least two hours for all the participants to enter when the event hall opens at 10 a.m. It seems like people line up so early because if they don't, they won't be able to buy their favorite circles book or the goods they want from the industry area. Since Sakura is weak, and because this is our first time participating, we decided to enter at noon. This is... This is the real Kami Pro! Wow. I stand besides the dumbfounded Sakura I had a loss for words. At this ridiculously huge event space, every possible space is submerged in waves of people. No matter where you turn, it's people, 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 too many peoples. The fact that all these people are walking around the event of different goals, and yet the event still comes all together, it's very amazing. I now know firsthand, I now know firsthand why Sakura said, there are no customers, everyone is a participant. Well then, shall we go get changed first? Changed? Ikuro-san, this way. Sakura leads me to a changing space set up in the corner of the event space. She opens the bulky suitcase I brought from Tokyo... Tokyo? From Tomoe Dormitory. Inside there is some showy-looking costumes. You said this was a surprise to look forward to for when we got here, but... Ikuro-san, please get a cosplay permit. <laughs> I'm gonna say permit. And wear this costume. I'm gonna cosplay? And let me guess, it's gonna be Samurai Maiden. And Ikuro will be the best friend that confess confessed his love to her. It's okay. I will be with you. When I see Sakura's sparkling eyes, I just can't say no. Though honestly, I'm not really that opposed to the idea, because it sounds like fun. Cosplay. Costume play. It's dressing up in the costumes of characters from fiction and playing as your character. Cosplayers, people who cosplay, of anime and manga are said to be the one of the main sites to see at Comic Pro. I put on my costume in the changing room. Sakura gave me a 19th century navy uniform costume. This is like the main character, not manga. Oh, they're dressing up from people in their manga. Which means... Well, well, well! Just as I thought! It suits you well, Ikiro-san! Sakura's wearing a lovely traditional Japanese-style costume. It's the outfit of the namesake of Samurai Maiden, Sugoi-chan. Wow, no way, super cute. Sa Sakura, you look really, really cute. If I wanted to resemble Sa Sugoi chan, should I cut my hair then? No, your hair is, your hair is the cutest. It's just so Yamato Narashiko, I love it. Y yes! Thank you! Sorry to trouble you. Uh, 
Man, I want to compliment her more, but words aren't enough. I made the main character into a marine from your country. It suits you just as I planned. But man, when did you, when did you get these costumes ready? And when did you get Ikuro's measurements? They aren't unrealistic costumes, so I was able to rent similar costumes from a costume rental shop and just rearrange them a little. Oh, I see. Our outfits aren't very fantastical designs. They're pretty close to actually exist existing outfits, so they didn't have to be made from scratch. Okay, shall we go? I can tell Sakura can't wait just by looking at her enthusiac enthusiastic expression. Well then, princess, let us go. Since I'm wearing such a cool outfit, try to sing a, a really pretentious line. Ikido san, that's not a character. He doesn't call Sugoi chan a princess. Hey, Sugoi, I'll uncover you soon. Good, very nice. What's going on? Well, if Sakura is enjoying herself, that's what counts. You start to head out towards the rest of Comic Pro. Comic Pro. Hello. But it doesn't happen so easily. And they're already taking pictures. Excuse me, please look over here. Yeah, yes? L like this? Please, say your catchphrase. A samurai doesn't fear death. Thank you. If you want, I'll send you the photo. Please tell me your email address. And just give it out to your fingers. Oh, yes. Um, after walking just a little, a man with a fancy single reflex lens camera calls out to us. He wants to take a photo of Sakura's costume. As she lets him take a photo, another person stops. More and more people who want to photograph her gather. And at some point, it turns into a line, and we can't move at all. Well, I can understand. Sakura's beautiful. Me and her Sagoichan cosplay is absolutely super cute. Plus, Summer Maiden has a anime airing in it at the peak and it and is at the peak of popularity so of course when they see her they want to take a photo um excuse me girl who appears to be a middle uh, can't speak a middle schooler calls out to me do you need something oh wow you understand Japanese she claps her hands in delight um mister what is your cosplay of this is an original character from our manga. Point towards Sakura as I speak. Oh, I knew it! I thought it looked like a character from S Samurai Maiden, but I never saw it before. Well, yeah, of course not. Um, um, what kind of man manga is it? Um, uh, what was the title again? Sakura finally comes back after the first wave of photographers dies down. Sakura, what was the title of our manga? It's still undecided. I thought I should choose it after finishing the last page. By the way, who is this? She's probably going to be your first fan, Sakura. Huh? I guess Sakura a brief explanation of what's going on. Oh, it's an it's embarrassing to explain my own manga. Well, you see, Sakura sums up her manga as much as she can without spoiling the, the story. Wow, sounds great. I want to read it. Oh no, it's still not finished. What? Oh man. So I'll definitely come to Winter Comic Pro and so that has a circle. I'll definitely come. I'm really looking forward to it. 
The girl and Sucker exchanged email addresses. By the way, is he your boyfriend? Uh, he wishes. No, he's my friend. Though, he's a special friend, and that's like my family. Yeah, I know, I know. But it hurts to hear her, hear her say it so bluntly. Couldn't you at least get a little bit embarrassed? Oh, uh, really? Since you since you have matching costumes, I thought for sure. Okay then, I'll see, I'll come see you in the winter. The girl waves and disappears into the sea of people. <laughs> matching costumes? Sakura compares her outfit with mine. She tilts her head and thinks. Sakura is Sugoi-chan, and I'm cosplaying a foreign marine original character for her manga. In the manga, the two of them fall in love, so. Sakura's face suddenly turns bright red. Speaking way too fast, Sakura. Ikuro-san, um, um, I, no, I, I didn't mean to, um, that is, um, oh. Uh. Sakura, <laughs> calm down. Uh, now, now that you mention it, yes! If you hear the story, that's the only conclusion to come to. Sakura shocked and fidgets. I didn't think that far. I'm so sorry, Ikuro-san. I've troubled you. You don't have to apologize. Really? I don't mind if people get the wrong idea. Um, um, what do you? Sakura gets embarrassed and hangs her head. If you react like this, you're gonna make me embarrassed too. Anyway, let's look around. The place is so huge, we'll never have enough time. First, we go searching for a samurai maiden doujinshi. I thought that wasn't available until the second day. Oh well. Samurai maiden was popular in the first place, and now the anime is airing. There's a huge number of circles putting out doujinshi for it, and it would be physically impossible for us to look at all. Look at them all. There's so many. Sakura whispers dumbfoundedly. What should we do? No point in worrying. Let's look at everything from start to finish. Sakura enthusiastically speaks to a circle member. Um, can I look at this book? Go ahead. Look all you want. Sakura earnestly inspects the doujinshi. Sometimes after being conflicted for a while, Sakura returns the doujinshi to its spot. It seems like she has quite quite high standard for what to buy. Even so, her paper bag is getting bigger and bigger before my eyes. I use more money than I planned. Sakura looks a bit pale. But I don't regret it. These are all wonderful doujinshi. The the love they have for the original manga really shines through. Yeah, there's so many variations, comic trips, comedies, parodies, battles. They come up with so many different things based on the same source material. They are all so amazing. It makes me want to redraw many parts of my own manga. Maybe you should take that frustration and put it into making a new manga. Yes, you're right. I'll do that. If I complete this one, there's always the next one. Next, we check out the summer maiden booth in the commercial area. Everything's probably sold out by now, but I thought we should at least take a look at what's on display. Ikuro-san, look at this! You're selling this? 
In the glass showcase, there's a golden pocket watch. This watch was bestowed upon Sagoichan by the ruler of Satsuma Domain, Nariakira. Nari she treasures it and carries it everywhere with the utmost care. This is a replica of it. The display panel says each one has a serial number with only 315 made. Wow. 315 seems like such a random number. Oh! In Japanese, 3 can be read as sa, uh, as 1 as I, and 5 as go. So it spells out sugoi. Almost, without the U. This kind of, this kind of play on words takes me a while to figure out if it's not if it's not my native language. And the price is expensive. 50,000 yen? Expensive. So 500 bucks. Yeah, no matter how well made it is, of course it's not sold out. The maker went overboard with this one. Maybe a hundred dollars would have been a better price or fifty. For me personally, I probably only pay fifty bucks for it though. Sakura looks at the pocket watch with passionate eyes. Sakura, you want it? Because apparently you could have switch. Rich. Yes, but I don't have enough money on hand. I didn't expect to regret my purchases already. Sakura gives a frustrated sigh. Wow, so you have no problem taking my money. <laughs> I will ask you just in case, Hikido-san. How much do you have on hand? Unfortunately, my wallet's empty too. Maybe they'll give it to you for free because they like your costume. Oh, just wishful thinking though. Well, no choice then. Let's look at some other stuff and get back to our senses. Sakura moves along the shelves, looking at the goods that are sold out. I lied to Sakura. <laughs> really? <laughs> I actually have enough money left to buy this watch. To be exact, have hid it, have it hidden in my shoe as emergency funds to be used only when necessary. I was told to only use it when I absolutely had to, but... I decided that now is that time. They just lied to her. Oh. I uh, sneakily buy it. Well, Ikido is rich. Jeez. I sneakily take out the money, and when Sakura is distracted, I buy the replica of pocket watch. I'm gonna give it to Sakura as a present. Using this, I'm gonna make the perfect romantic confession. I doubt you'll be able to get it right. The second day of Comic, Comic Promenade 86 is now over. Thank you everyone for attending in this heat. Those, we, eh. those of you coming back tomorrow, see you tomorrow. And those coming in winter, see you then. Grand wave of applause spreads over the event center. It's over. Yeah. We ended up overstaying. I really intended to leave earlier, though. Oh well, let's kill a little more time. Some hasty circles and participants already left so they could try to avoid the time when the tra trains get crowded. The hall's already sparse with people. It's kind of lonely. It's always lonely after a festival, but there's always next time. You'll get to enjoy it again. Hi. Yes! Sakura answers me with a smile as she crafts a circle application form for the next comic, Promenade 87. We also have the field trip! Kaito has many spots related to Sugoi Takamori after all. Let's definitely go to Kiyomizu Dera! It, it's Sichi Jinrei, a pilgrimage to locations in anime. I definitely can't make it to Winter and Comic Pro, but at least we can go on the field trip together. I'm really looking forward to it. Ikido-san, thank you. You're welcome. 
Not just for today, but for taking me this far. Sakura, I think you're really the one who brought me here. No, I had to shut myself away in a shell. I just stayed complacent and used my condition as an excuse. Ikaro-san, you are the one who brought me out of that. Sakura, this is the right mood, but it will get ruined, because that's always what happens. If I'm gonna confess to her, it's gotta be now. Sakura, I. And she looks like she's gonna drop dead. Well, not drop dead, pass out. You are. Sakura's body sways slightly. She looks as though she's about to faint, and I catch her. Her body is so hot, it makes me shiver. Sakura, you have a terrible fever! Why didn't you tell me? Because. It's okay, you don't have to talk. Let's hurry back. Just take her to the hospital. It was so fun. Sakura manages to squeeze out some hardly intelligible mumbles. I was happy. Okay, just hold on to me. I prop up Sakura and head towards the taxi pickup area. It'll be expensive, but I can't worry about that. I need to get Sakura back to Tomoe Dormitory as soon as possible. We head towards Tokyo Station in the taxi, and then take a train from there towards Okawa. In the meantime, I contact Aoi on the phone and explain the situation. When I arrive at the station, there's already a car waiting to take Sakura to the dormitory. Aoi nurses Sakura nonstop all night long. Even so, Sakura's fever doesn't go down. Sakura doesn't show any improvement at all, so she's hospitalized in the city. We make plans to all go visit her on one of Karen's days off. An email arrives explaining that Sakura has been transferred to a specialty hospital her relatives run in Kyoto for an examination. Of course we can't go visit her. Is Sakura gonna die? I think I would cry if Sakura died. Sakura's mail reassures us that it's just for an examination, so she'll return soon. Oh, that's helpful, but... But one day passes, two days pass, and she still doesn't contact us to say the examination is finished. Is she in a coma? Just thinking the worst out already. Sakura still hasn't returned to Tomei Dormitory. What about the field trip? Still no contact from Sakura Chan. Yeah, not a peep since she got sent to Kyoto, and I can't get in touch with that, that idiot Shirakawa either. What on earth is going on? <laughs> and the dog. Oh, the first time I'm actually texting AOA and Karen. The only people I texted was AOA's grandfather. I'm very worried. She said she'd be right back. What an idiot, making us worry so much. Do you think we should call our parents' house? We can, but our school trip is soon too, right? Oh yeah, we're going to Kyoto. That's where so Sakura is hospitalized. Right. Mm. Right. So let's go see her during our free time on the trip. Cherry Blossom has entered the chat room. Oh. Good evening. Sakura-chan! Sakura! It's you! Sakura! Oh. Sakura! Why is there four people in the chat now? Hello, everyone. It's been a while. Are you okay, Sakura-chan? Hey, why didn't you tell us how you're doing? Sakura, we were all worried. I'm very sorry for making you all concerned about me. I couldn't use my phone, and I've been busy going through many examinations. Examinations, huh? So are you better now? Yes, thank you. It's not as bad now. 
Oh, great. And then all those freckles. Jeez, you really don't get how worried we were. I can't emphasize enough how sorry I am. Okay, okay, no more apologies. So, when are you coming back? Well, I still have to stay at the hospital for a little while longer. How about the f How about the school trip? I'm very sorry to tell you that I can't fulfill my promise to show you around Kyoto. That's fine. We'll just be the ones going to see you. We'll visit. Oh no, I'd feel bad. Please don't worry about me and just and just enjoy the sights in Kyoto. Hey, Sakura. Oh, my doctor is coming. I must go. Excuse me. Cherry Blossom has left the chat room. Sakura-chan? Sakura? Such an idiot. 